IDH in Rwanda is implementing a hot invest project that is funded by the Dutch government. But the purpose of the mechanization workshop is to provide uh, to the companies, SMEs we are working with, uh, farming solutions that are available on the market. Point Grow is a Dutch based company delivering farm solutions to African businesses. Uh, we deliver knowledge, we deliver logistic and financial solutions. We also back up that with implementation support and market linkage. Uh, what we are presenting at the moment is uh, subsoiling, a spading machine, uh, a bed former and a planting. This interesting workshop because it is a lot of knowledge and it is practically a scene what we call uh, learning by doing. We learned a lot about the different types of equipment Go and Grow can supply. So it was very interesting to see what benefits it can have for, for a farm and comparing them also to the return on or the investments that uh, you initially have to make as a business. Yeah, the benefits are many, but I would say mostly the efficiency in the farm, uh, the yield maximization through the good soil making. With these machines, we managed to save a lot of money. Irrigation costs have really gone down because of the way the machines prepare the soil and the soil is able to hold water for a long time. When we are doing planting, the machine put one seed. But when you are people planting, they can put maybe two or three seeds. And then when you buy seed, it's by one. So you are missing maybe two seeds, so which means you can save more by just using the machine than just human being. A small time we saw all kinds of activities that can be performed by a tractor. There is no doubt that the tractor quickens all the farming activities. Using these um, techniques, they give us good yield production, good quality. So it really helps us to, to, to plan for the market and to respond as well for the market for the demand. Taking an example of 20 hectare operations, uh, French lease production grown twice a year, we have calculated the return on investment with this mechanization set we have here today that within two years time as an entrepreneur you can earn back your investment uh, with a net profit of about 40 million Rwanda funds. We have seen uh, improvements in the in the sector since our support started. These companies are able to supply from 80 to 100 metric tons per week. And when we started, they were from eight to 10 metric tons per week. It was a, a good impression indeed. The ministry is encouraging people who are doing mechanization. We are so glad that not only the government is putting effort, but uh, uh, external investors and uh, development partners are uh, engaging in mechanization. We are working closely with Grow and Grow in case we need any spare part on time and the good thing is that they also manage to train our staff on how to use all of these implements. This is was very very important training and workshop so I think it's yeah we need more. We would like to explore further for different crops and different types of equipment. Mechanization is the way to go if you want to maximize the land preparation, the land use in Rwanda, and if you want to do uh, farming as a business.